بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ویلکم ٹو انادر ویڈیو آن ریکویسٹ سبمیشنس ان اوریکل آر ٹویلف نارملی اٹ از یوز بائی ایوری یوزرس بٹ موسٹ آف دا یوزرس دے ڈونٹ نو ایگزیکٹ فنکشنلٹی اویلیبل ان دیز ریکویسٹ سبمیشن سو اٹ از انڈر ویو ریکویسٹ let me show you and submit a new request right okay from here you will select your request let's say for example I'm selecting active user okay <coughs> now you see down here you will enter parameters if there are any parameters so since this request has no parameter so it is not showing anything okay now for example Uh, this is a heavy request I mean it takes too much time it can uh, add too much load so what you can do instead of running during uh, working hours you can schedule it for night so it will automatically run at night and once you will come in the morning you can open the request and uh, open the uh, output so it will not add load during the daytime <coughs> okay so what we'll do we'll schedule it right or if there is a job which you have to schedule let's say for example you have to send invoices uh, through email like email bursting or something else so what we'll do we'll click on the schedule so by default the first one is selected which you submit and it start executing in the queue okay okay next is once so once you will give once and you will select let's say for example if i am putting it uh, uh, night time i'm just giving example for example 11 or 10 10 pm right so what it will do it will be scheduled and will execute at 10 pm so there will be no load during working hours okay this is one time only right there can be something else or programs or scheduling or something like that which are periodic periodic means frequently you have to run those right maybe you have to pull some data from some interface or you know uh, or any other uh, legacy system or you have to keep updating something or you have to send notifications or you have to update workflows whatever so here it is a periodically so what you do here you have the rerun every the frequency so you can run every day every month every week hour minute now it is up to you how you want to run it right this is and then there is another <coughs> and then just submit it will be scheduled i will show you how to uh, find the scheduled one okay on specific day now let's say for example you have a requirement to run this request on every last day of the month so you can select here this one right so this is selected now because you don't know what will be the last day it can be 30 28 29 or 30 was whatever last day of the month or if you want let's say for example specific day let's say for example 7th 14 21 28 and last day of month or after 21 last day of month right so this will be the schedule and you can select here the uh, time so fourth will be the starting date here you can put the time and if you want let's say for example to be end dated on certain date you can put it there there as well okay if you don't want this uh, by day uh, schedule with the dates then you can also select the day let's say for example uh, you want to say if instead of every sunday right so it will at this time every sunday this will be executed right and you can submit okay after this here normally there are few uh, reports which will be uh, having xml publisher uh, uh, xml templates right for that you will find one name here once you will some uh, uh, select here the request name and then you can click on options here the format will be excel or pdf you can change the format from here and then you can submit right this is how it is okay there is another way let's say for example here 
you want to see the output even you can schedule here to send email so let's say for example if you have some um, email which you have to send to specific users um, or your manager or your customer or your supplier whatever so what you can do this report will be emailed let's say info at the rate com right and then you can put your this will be from email and here you can put the two right if you have any cc you can put it the cc and it the email will be and, and and here you can change the subject as per your subject right and okay if it is scheduled so every uh, as per that schedule it will keep sending that email using your exchange server and uh, if it is not scheduled one time it will send one time and that's it okay now you can submit this one i'm not going into a request set it's okay so if you have to find any request you can click here the find then you can go to specific request and if you go to status you can find the scheduled right so once you will click scheduled it will show you the scheduled one see here these are normally workflows so it is scheduled one it will be pending so once their time will come they will be executed and another will be scheduled right so in this way you can manage your requests very easily and sometimes users set in the evening let's say okay they are not running during the uh, working hours so you don't need to do that you can just schedule any time during the day and it will be executed at night you can email uh, even uh, printing is also possible if printer is configured and you can just leave at 5 o'clock and process will be done automatically right i think uh, now it will be easy for you to understand how you can uh, submit the request and schedule them with the uh, submit with the schedule right uh, if there is any question please um, you can ask under the video thank you very much allah hafiz